Mike, here's the here's a bunch of copies of the burn plan map. The objective of the bird, according to the burn plan, is to stimulate warm season grass growth in that woodland, so the woodland area, uh, to control woody plants. So a lot of these sprouts, the idea is to get a little bit more of an aggressive fire in here uh, to set back. We're not going to kill them, but to set them back. Um, some background there, if we set them back, we get those nice new succulent growing uh, sprouts come through the summer. That'll be awesome deer browse. Uh, and that's what he's after. This whole property is kind of geared toward hunting, deer hunting and turkey hunting, wildlife management. So, uh, and uh, reduce wildfire hazard. Don't know if we'll really accomplish that today. Um, stimulate forbs, we should very easily accomplish that goal and remove litter and create bare ground, and we're gonna accomplish that. Right. Good mix. Real good mix. Like it's, it's going about yeah. what we want, doesn't it? Yeah, that's good behavior right now. Mm -hmm. I don't like the variability in the winds, and yeah. so what we're, what we're gonna do, and this is what Michael was saying, is to play it safe here, we are going to take extra time to burn this corner out completely first okay. before we go into okay. going wide. Okay. And thinning up our resources. Right now we're doing a lot of interior ignition. Right now we're using a firing technique called a, a strip fire, where we're coming down the middle of the ridge, interior of the unit, to gain more fuel consumption quickly. Once we're comfortable with how much interior ignition we have with these strip fires, then we're gonna go to the south end of the unit and start the head fire with the wind. Sun's going down, the humidity's starting to rise, and the wind speed is, is decreasing just a little bit. And so with most of the interior burnt, and uh, basically a line around all three sides, we're gonna be lighting the head fire here very shortly. And that'll be, that's always the fun part, the easy part, the part where you don't have to eat smoke. So we're looking forward to it. All right, yeah, so we're starting the head fire. You can see it's a little bit, fire behavior's a little bit crazy right here because of the super steep slope, southern exposure. But when it gets up into that timber, it's gonna slow down quite a bit, finish out, and we will have completed a, a uh, very successful prescribed fire. So when I first started this, I started it for just primarily deer habitat management. And uh, after the first burn, I noticed it was just everything exploded. I've changed from primarily deer habitat management to wildlife management. I've been seeing quail out here now. I never saw that before. Uh, doves like crazy in September are out here. The songbirds have exploded. Uh, rabbits are out here now. Nothing. Uh, I never saw any of those uh, before. So just the wildlife increase in general has been incredible from, from the birds.